ride with Nelly. Hen Cappy Grand Fondo training ride. At least 100 k's today, uh, rolling hills, which is I'm gonna head up and around, which is gonna be 10 miles uphill. You'll see on the topography on the Strava. Down into the valley, back up another steep one, jump on the SDBC loop, those that know where that is. Uh, make my way back to the coast and then uh, finish up with some Torrey Pines and back down and around, back to the driveway. Peace, you ride with Nelly. All right, about three miles from the driveway to the valley floor through a residential, and then you begin the climb. Four, six percent for the next nine plus miles up uh, to the highest point of the day, which I do know that from looking at the Strava topography. But you're riding with Nelly, Henkepi Grand Fondo training, trying to feel healthy, trying to feel at my best, to be my best for my family. And uh, just out for a Saturday morning bike ride. I may run into a group and sit on a couple wheels, but I will not rev it up and take it into any kind of red zone. Uh, just to watch my breathing, heart rate, monitor that. So. Out 400 Ks so I can feel good with a rest stop on the 50 with all my friends and supporters out there. So I look forward to seeing you guys out there. Ride with Nelly. Ride with Nelly back. Uh, 10 miles in the driveway, 45 minutes uphill. Um, took my time, kept the heart rate. Had a decent problem. How's that? But uh, I'm up here on the recreational side, ready for the Henkepi Grand Fondo. Uh, out for a quick 100 Ks. Should have tired legs when I'm done, but that's because I'm old. Anyway, we're at the highest point of the day. Uh, we're gonna head down and around, back up again, and then down into the valley. You'll see that in a moment. You're right, Winelli. <sighs> right, Winelli just made a left turn on Artesian Road, Artesian Estates. So this road, this residential road, which is private on the other side, uh, will take me to the valley floor where there could be a water crossing since we had a little rain. Um, that's about it. So uh, it even says no outlet because there's a gate at the other end if you don't have the code. All right, this is going to loop us into uh, the SDBC loop stud loop portion and uh and i'll make my way over to costa and the coast so we're just taking our time you ride with nelly sit the wheel listen to some music let's go downhill
Ravinelli back. Just finishing up on the stud loop. Uh, it is what the title is for all you guys that got it like that. Hang on, I gotta make a right turn with traffic. So, now is the time on this residential road. I uh, basically make my way to a road called La Costa, uh, which is a famous cycling route in this SoCal area that this road I'm on. So it's well traveled by cyclists. The residential uh, residents should know that, or they do know that. So we're heading on over to the coast now. You ride with Nelly. Ravinelli back on the coast, heading southbound. Slight cross headwind uh, for an unconsiderable amount of distance. Sitting at 35 miles solo already this morning. Energy feels good. Legs feel okay out for a recreational ride, solo or sit in the wheel. You ride with Nelly. back going through a beach town called Lucadia right at the top of the hour and uh, the SDBC 8 group should swoop me up and uh, blow through how's that I'm just gonna sit on stay within my heart rate and my pace for a Saturday morning ride top of the hour 10 o'clock ride with Nelly 38 miles into it peace
Martinelli recap. Uh, 60 miles, like I said, a little over four hours. All of it was pretty much done solo. Um, hope you enjoyed the music along and sitting the wheel. And uh, I feel pretty good for the Hencappy Grand Fondo. If I did 60 miles by myself, 50 should be easy riding with the group and stopping at the rest areas. So, you're riding with Nelly. We'll see you at the Hencappy Grand Fondo. Peace. Stay fit.